guys, it's Lucy and today is going to be um, a um, treat video, my treat inventory for my hamsters and the mice and the rats. Um, just before this, these are treats so they're fed occasionally, uh, not fed um, day to day basis. Um, but today I'm here with Flora, um, if I have to stop her so often it's because Flora is escaping. So, let's get started. So. Some of the first things they get is sultanas and raisins. So these are fed to um, the Syrians and the mice and the most because they are very high in sugar. So I have to be very careful with the dwarfs. So they get those um, sparingly. So let's give one to Flora now because she's being a bit naughty. Um, so yeah. Then the hamsters and mice also get seed treats. And these are the Wilco's budgie and parakeet um, and cockatiel bars. And these are 50p each. Um, I've already used two of them because I've broke them into little bits and gave them to them. So I'm probably going to save these for around Christmas this time. Um, or if I go away somewhere. So I've got those. I have to get pick, pick up more of those. Next for dog biscuits. So these are really good for protein. I have the Pedigree Biscroc Milky Bones. And I got um, these on Fiverr. And I've used up quite a lot of them because I've been making toys with them my pets and been making treats with them as well by crushing them up etc etc um but the hamsters really like these okay for next for dog treats i have this bag of pick and mix stuff you can do at pet shops this is at pampered pets i've got a quite a big bag of them this is there's not there wasn't as many of this in here as there was but there's still quite a few i've got a bag of these i believe i have a receipt in here yeah, hard to see. Um, for I got two hundred and sixty grams, and that was ninety six p. So I got those. So more on to the more um your basic hamster kind of stuff. I got some Wilco's milk drops, and these are definitely a must have. I think with only hamsters. Um, I give these to hamsters and I give them to the mice very occasionally but I've got to be careful because um, rodents such as hamsters, rats and mice are lactose intolerant which means they can't have milk or dairy products so I thought I was trying to escape um, so I've got these and again these are very rare treat. I haven't had milk drops in a while so then also going on the drop line I've got these Vitacraft drops and Flora's escaping she's escaped so yeah, I've got these Vitacraft dropped in the carrot flavour. Flora, you can go back. <laughs> um, so these I occasionally, I give these to the dwarfs a bit more because they're actually sugar free as it says that. So I give those to them more often. Flora's trying to escape again. <laughs> um, so next I've got the Purina Deli Bake Dog Snacks and the Shaped Stars. And I've actually broken these up into pieces. And the hamsters really like these. Um, the rats aren't too big of a fan on meat kind of stuff, but they really like these. Flora escaping again. <laughs> Oi! She's being naughty. <laughs> she's on heat as well, so she smells. Um, next, for cat and pet stuff, I've got the Mixed Grill um, Felix. Um, I think they're by Purina, I think Felix is. Um, but these are the beef, chicken and salmon ones. And they, hamsters don't really like these. They don't really pay attention to them. Let's see if Flora or Dyke on. Oh, Flora. Yeah, again, she doesn't really like some of these. So I'm going to have to end up giving these to my neighbour for her cat who I've been um, cat sitting for. Um, so next for cat, I've got some cat food. Um... This is the um, Go Cat and this is the chicken, rice and vegetable one. Um, so the hamsters now have this mixed into the food as well as the hamsters and the rats get a little bit. So that's good for protein. So next I have, I was escaping, um, I have the Brit Animals hamster food. And this is only sold at Pampered Pets as far as I know. And it's a... Pellet food, there's the spoon. Um, I can do a review on this if anyone wants to, I can um, do a review. And also by Brit Animals, I have got the Brit Animals um, alfalfa snacks, and I got these the other day. And um, the animals don't seem too fast on them, um, but Flora will take them, so I'll keep them for Flora. Um, so 
I've got a couple more things left. I've got some goji berries I got from Chinchilla's shop and they're just basically little red berries and all the animals really like these, especially the rats. And last of all, out of all my treats, I've got my homemade treats and these are ones I actually made today and you can see these on my Facebook page. I'm going to do a um, how to make them video but they're kale um, dipped, um, I call them crazy conkers. Um, so I'm actually selling these on my shop which I'm going to do a separate video on. Um, so yeah, the hamsters really like these. I haven't tried them with the mice yet so I'll have to see what they think. Um, so yeah guys, that's all my treats. Hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys on the next day. Bye bye.